Hello again and welcome to the 6th Annual GPCA Forum here in Dubai. I'm now talking to Maurizio Buti, the uh, Chief Operating Officer of Songwon International. Maurizio, Songwon's made uh, a couple of announcements at GPCA this week about an acquisition in Germany and some investments in the Middle East. Could you um, describe those in a bit more detail? Yeah, uh, one of the significant part of the uh, market for additives is actually covered by a specific form which is called one pex which is a, a combination of additives in a granular form and uh, especially in certain part of the world middle east particularly uh, this is actually the preferred uh, way of feeding uh, additives so for us it was important to have access to this kind of uh, market and of course, uh, uh, Middle East is very important because it's growing very fast, especially for the polyolefin industry. So the acquisition uh, in Germany allows us to uh, get access to a technology we, which we consider good, which will be used then to establish manufacturing uh, capabilities based on that technology in two locations in the Middle East, uh, in Saudi Arabia and in Abu Dhabi. We have decided that the one pack operation will be managed globally uh, with partners and we have identified the two uh, partners in the Middle East. One is from Saudi Arabia, it's called Pangalf uh, Corporation, and the other one uh, from Abu Dhabi, Policies uh, Corporation. I think that, uh, uh, especially in the Middle East, uh, a local partner can bring a lot of benefit to the operation of the company, especially. And this, I think, is an advantage uh, that uh, we should not renounce to when uh, we uh, decide to come to this region. So these one-pack products are basically uh, intended to go into polyolefins. Could you um, say what the growth for these in the market is, both globally and the Middle East? The market in the Middle East, uh, the polymer market in the Middle East is growing uh, very fast. It's actually the fastest growing area in the world. And uh, in the Middle East, uh, as I said, the majority of the additives are actually uh, fed to the polymer as one packs. So the growth of one pex in this region is uh, very significant. Um, the market in general for additives globally is also growing and uh, we expect growth between four and five percent as an average per year. Of course, with peaks uh, of demand and, uh, and downturns like, uh, for example, what is happening in the last six months, which is a little Bit of, uh, there is a little bit of slowdown, but is a market that actually has a very good potential for growth uh, for the foreseeable future. Two years ago, you opened um, an office in Bahrain as the first move into the Middle East, and now you have these two investments. Could you elaborate on your future plans for the region? What um, what more developments do you have in the pipeline? Yeah. <clears throat> that was uh, our first step uh, in the region. We actually supply the region uh, with products that are coming from Korea or from Europe. Uh, but our intention was definitely to have a local presence, uh, both in terms of manufacturing, as I said before, these two uh, investments that we are planning in Saudi Arabia and in Abu Dhabi. But we also are going to establish a sales and marketing company in the region. Exact location still uh, to be determined because there are several options. And we consider this market as one of the most important uh, for us uh, in the future. The, the next step of expansion will depend very much on how the market develops. It can be a, an expansion of one pex activities can also be a back integration on production of antioxidants, depending how the situation develops. Okay, thank you very much. Thank to you.